Well, the prelims, we had a little incident where I didn't hear the start go off, so I swam it by myself. So I was really grateful to be able to make the final in the event and come back from this morning with a little bit of adrenaline and different mindset. So I knew what I had to do going into finals. I was like, hard morning, but it'll be better than night. And I'm really happy with my result today. So me and another few of the athletes in the race, we didn't hear the take your mark, but we heard the beep. I was the only one who didn't go off. So I stepped down and I was like, I can't, I didn't hear the take your mark. Is it okay if I swim again? And I swam by myself and yeah, I just didn't hear it. And then they let me swim again. I was a little overwhelmed, but my teammates really helped calm me down and everyone reassured me that I was allowed to swim again. So. I went to the warm down pool, just got ready. I knew I was going to swim in 20 minutes. And then I had this whole crowd cheering for me and it made me feel really motivated to hit my time and make the A final. I'm pretty happy with the meet overall. I hit a best time in the 100 fly yesterday and I placed second and I was really happy with it. It was like 52.5, so it was just a great experience. It's my last one since I'm 18, so I was just happy to finish it with all my teammates behind me. It's truly about the team culture. It's just, the team is nothing like any other team I've experienced from taking all officials. And I'm just so grateful for the opportunity to be recruited. And I'm so excited to train with them next year. They're all such a sweet group of guys and girls. So, and the coaching staff, they're amazing.